Hey, what's up guys? So today is a little bit different because we're gonna be talking about what's in our camera bag 2019. A lot of you have been asking what we use to vlog with. And so we thought, you know what, let's go ahead and show you guys. And plus, this helps me because I'm leaving for Romania in six days and I'm trying to pack and get all my stuff together. So this is helping me kind of sort through what I'm taking uh, for this trip. But also this is kind of what we take for, for vlogs when we go travel, things like that. What you see in this camera bag is kind of what we use to travel with, period. Okay, so I am going to start with our camera bag. Before I do that, right now I'm actually recording on my iPhone and I want to switch out cameras, but I wanted to show you our new piece of hardware Which we're really excited about by the way We've been vlogging with our phone for about a year. We finally upgraded the last maybe three months or so um, But if you're wanting to vlog you want to start out man, just use what you got um, That's what we've been doing. It's crazy the quality of cameras and phones nowadays we were recording in 4k 24 frames per second on an iphone 10s and it, it was amazing it was amazing so um just go at it you don't need to have crazy equipment crazy cameras things like that just start with what you got and just make videos but what we ended up getting is the sony a6400 and we love it like seriously Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, it has the kit lens um, on this guy. It's a 16 to 50 millimeter and uh, it, it's it's great. I mean, it has enough widescreen to be able to vlog. It does some amazing B-roll. It, it's it, I mean, it's it's insane. I love it. Um, the crazy cool thing about this, it has a thing called the E-mount, which basically what that means is we can actually take other Sony glass and be able to put on here and actually have different kinds of lenses right on this body. So we're pretty stoked about it. Records in 4K, uh, 24 frames is what we usually record in. Um, goes to 30, even 60, even 120 frames per second for that really nice slow motion. Um, but we love it. Uh, this actually has a cage around it, so it looks a little bit bigger. This is a mirrorless camera, by the way. So it looks a little bit bigger, but we have this because it kind of protects it, but also we're able to put different kind of accessories around it. Um, but when we're kind of vlogging around town, we usually just take it off and we just have kind of this slimmer profile. But one of our favorite features of this guy is actually this little, this guy right here, okay? We're actually able to take this up to be able to frame our shot. So when we're vlogging, we are actually able to be able to see kind of what's going on. Look at that. You have this over here. Lacey's actually right over there just hanging out and so is Landon. <laughs> so this actually kind of shows us, um, you know, just making sure that we're in frame and we're not out of frame. By the way, we still use the iPhone all the time. Um, it is kind of like our B camera. So we have our A camera now and our iPhone is our B camera. So I'm going to go ahead and switch out cameras. And, uh, and then after that, we'll get started on what's in our camera bag. So without further ado, intro. Okay guys, welcome back. So I'm going to start out with our camera bag. So we have this guy right here, which is the, the Pro Tactic 450 by Low Pro. Um, I love this, love this bag. This bag is so amazing. Like you have like all this, like these straps right here. You can kind of hang things off of here. I have my beats right here, just kind of hanging. I have a tripod over here. I'll have my neck pillow hanging, things like that. This guy right here, just put carabiners everywhere and just let it hang down. This bag reminds me of something you'd see in James Bond right before he maybe like jumps out of the helicopter or something like that. I just, I love this bag so much. It has a, a hard top right here, kind of a thing. So you're able to, you know, be able to just put some gear in here that's not gonna get, you know, broken or things like that. Uh, but also what I really like about this bag is simply the main compartment is actually right on the back side. So you don't have to worry about people getting in your bag when they're not supposed to because you know why? It's right against your back, which I love that. So we're gonna show you what is in our camera bag right now. Nothing, because I had to lay it all out to make the thumbnail photo. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead one by one, show you kind of what we got and go from there. Okay, so the first compartment right here is kind of where we keep our personal stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and unzip this. And this is exactly what I'm gonna be taking on this trip. So we'll unzip this guy here. And what we got is, number one, playing cards. Because, playing cards. And then we have iPhone adapters. These things, I have like three or four of them 
actually probably more like 10 of them because they go disappearing all the time. So you need that. So there's that. iPhone cords. Um, I got a notepad. I got pen for all the customs and all that kind of stuff. And then Sharpie because you know what? You need a Sharpie. Sharpies come in handy. Sharpies are amazing. I love Sharpies. And Sharpies are... Uh, Excedrin because my head. And there's that. Uh, lock because I don't trust people. And uh, more adapters. And external power for my phone, iPad, whatever else I take. Um, adapter for... Hopefully this is where I'm going. Europe. Cool. And... Uh, Different, you know, cords for my beats and things like that. So that's kind of what's in this front pocket. Oh, yeah. And then also my passport. But take a look at this passport. This is pretty cool because it is Neverland right there. Check that out. It has the whole map and everything like that. Isn't that pretty cool? It's upside down. My bad. Look at that. It's so cool. And then inside here has Peter Pan just chilling out, loving life. It's pretty cool. So... Anyway, that is kind of what is in my personal area of the bag. And uh, yeah, pretty stoked, that's about it. Okay, and then in this side pocket right over here, I got AirPods. On this side of the pocket over here is gum. Because when you're traveling, you always need this. Okay, if it's some weird food you ate, or something you have in your mouth, or you woke up because you've been flying for nine, 10 hours and you, don't, you need to kind of brush your teeth. That is a must, especially when you're traveling overseas. Now, what I want to talk to you guys about a little bit is some bags that we have that go inside of our bag, okay? So as I open up this main compartment right over here, we have these two slots. Slot right here, slot right here, these big slots. And I actually have these little bags, these low pro bags right here that go right inside these little slots right there. And this one goes right inside here. And that actually just kind of organizes your bag. Now I'm not gonna kind of talk to you about how to organize on here because every every single person is different on how you organize your camera bag. Um, but uh, these are amazing. If you don't have some of these, buy them because they're phenomenal and you can put all kinds of different things in there and it just organizes your bag that much more. Okay, let's get to the good stuff. Speaking of these bags, this is actually where our A6400 goes into. It lives in here along with its SD cards, along with uh, the Rode mic that actually I'm using it to vlog into now, but you did see that on the thumbnail and also the first scene. Um, but that is what we use as uh, our Rode mic. And so that actually all fits in here. So the great thing is, is if we are going to Disneyland or going to the park, or if I'm going somewhere and uh, I don't want to take my entire James Bond on bag I can just take this little guy put it inside a little day pack and call it good I got the camera I got some extra batteries all that kind of stuff it stores all inside this little guy here and the second one is actually where our GoPro goes so I'm gonna actually go ahead and unzip this and kind of show you what that's all about but inside here we have all like the GoPro accessories and we actually have this guy right here which is our grip for the GoPro and here's our GoPro that is not our GoPro, that is a battery. So I'm gonna actually go ahead and find that GoPro. Where did the GoPro, here is, here's the GoPro right here. So all of this goes in here, including its SD card, all the accessories, all that fun stuff, even this guy right here, which is pretty cool because it can suction to a car and get some really cool shots. I'm hoping to use this, we haven't used this yet. So there is that. But that is what goes in those two little small bags. Next is I have the Osmo gimbal. This is for the smartphone, so I can get actually some really cool shots with it being really steady. It's just, it's just a gimbal. Um, it's pretty awesome there. And uh, I have uh, a Joby tripod, so I can use this to get some steady shots or just, you know, get some lock shots or whatever. Right here, this is for our A6400. Sony. Um, I love it. It's just, it's a tripod. It, it does its job, it does it well. It's great stuff. We have another tripod. This is for the iPhone, but also this is for the GoPro. Um, it's pretty cool because this is actually what we used to do all our vlogging on before we had our camera, but it actually kind of twists up like this and it can get a really cool reach. Um, you can actually use it to go down here like this and have a little tripod, kind of standoff tripod right here. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. It actually does quite a bit 
of stuff. You can kind of vlog just like this. It's it's actually made for vlogging with your phone, um, but and also your GoPro. So if you're looking to start vlogging, I would actually suggest getting this little tripod right here, and you should be should be set. Um, and then as far as the phone, because again, it's our B camera, we actually have this Shure MV88, which this is an amazing little mic. It does a phenomenal job of picking up some amazing vocals, um, sound, whatever. Um, so it's pretty awesome. And we also have this dead cat that goes over that. That way if there's crazy wind, it should block it. It should, I hate wind. I'm really actually excited about this because this is kind of the newest piece of hardware that has come into the family and that is the Mavic Air drone. I'm really excited about that. It comes with this. I have three additional batteries and also the remote right here. It's pretty cool. The thing is, is this is an amazing for traveling. It's so small. It, 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 look, look at this. this. This is my phone. This is my phone. That's the Mavic Air. It is like it's amazing you can put it in your back pocket i actually went for a run the other day i put it up i had the drone follow me which is kind of fun um and uh and i just put it in the back of my pocket and continued the run it was pretty awesome but also with the mavic air is they made it so the joysticks are removable actually i'll show you right here really fast that these joysticks are actually right inside here you can just take those off and screw them back on here and they made it so it's just easy to transport so the thought of everything, it's pretty awesome, and I'm really excited, and I hope to be able to fly this, but you know, there's a possibility it's not gonna happen because I'm in a different country, and there's that. And also we have, you know, dongles, and we have more dongles because Apple, and for SD cards, I have external hard drives to back up information. I even have this little flash drive to back up even more information. I am all about backing up, backing up, backing up because I've been in the position where I've lost so much information and so I kind of over back up at this point, but um, I want to come back with, <laughs> I want to come back with footage, okay? That's, that's, that is my goal. Also, I got gaffer's tape that goes in the camera bag. You never know when you need a good roll of gaffer's tape to just gaffer, I mean, Use your imagination. You can use all kinds of things with this right here. Um, and we have this little nifty guy. Um, this is for our European plug. But what I love about Apple is it actually has, um, Apple's charger actually converts it as well. So you have this little duck head right here for US. You take this little guy out and you're able to put this little guy right into there and now voila, you can plug this in to European outlets and it's all converted, ready to go. And also, I have the same thing with my MacBook Pro. And by the way, this is a 15 inch MacBook Pro, eight core. This thing does the job and it does it well. It is a beast. We use Final Cut Pro to edit and my goodness, <laughs> just take a moment and just, just thank you. Thank you for this machine. It is amazing. Anyway, so this guy right here um, is the charger for the MacBook Pro, but what's cool is I have this little plug bug guy. And this guy does the same exact thing. You take the duck head off of here, you slide this in here, you have a European outlet, also you have USB. Because the thing is, is with all of this stuff I just showed you, it's gonna take a lot of charging and I need a lot of outlets and a lot of places to plug things to recharge. But other than that, guys, that is pretty much what is in our camera bag. And there's a lot of other things I didn't want to show you because I didn't want to bore you. But hopefully you like this video. Um, I love watching what's in people's cameras bag so much. And uh, I don't know what it is. Lacey, on the other hand, doesn't care for it. That's why she's not even in the video. <laughs> but Lacey, really you want to come over here and close out this video? Yeah. So, but she will close out the video because it's done. Please be praying for me because I leave this Sunday. Pray for Lacey as well. Um, we, don't worry, we actually have vlogs that are gonna be airing, uh, so you won't miss out on those Tuesday mornings. Um, Am I in the frame? You're in the frame. Okay. Hi guys. <laughs> Sorry, I told him when he was gonna when we talked about this. I'm like, I really don't know what I would add to it because I don't know much about <laughs> all of our gear. He kind of does the majority of that. I am editing though, and I do love yeah. our MacBook. So. Lacey has been, she's been awesome. She's been doing a lot of the edits, so we kind of tag team the editing. Mm -hmm. Like, you want to explain kind of what you do real fast? Yeah. So what I usually do is I'll start off and I'll just do some of the big like 
just cuts throughout it, things I know aren't necessary in there. And then, She's a good editor. Yeah, just edit. And then I pass it along to him to add the sparkle. <laughs> they call it the cherry on top. If you guys have any questions on how we edit or what we use or how we use our gear or anything like that, let us know. We'd love to share with you. Um, but we just, you know, we, we try things and if we don't like it, we, we don't go that route and we find a new route. And so that's kind of how we've we found our workflow. Mm -hmm. But other than that, you guys have an amazing week and uh, we will see you next week for our next R0. But like this video if you liked it and subscribe as well. We love you guys. Bye. Bye. Now, I'm going to go ahead and start with my bag, but before that, now, now, so now I'm going to, so now, so now I'm going to, oh my gosh. okay, so I am at,